The CDC 6600 was designed by Seymour Cray in 1964. It was one of the world's first supercomputers, so it used transistors which generated an enormous amount of heat. This machine behind me used a new Freon cooling system to try and extract some of that heat and was actually designed in the shape of a cross to minimize the amount of wiring that it had to have. Machines like this were at the height of the Cold War. They were used by government research departments, they were used by universities. They were often used for actually calculating what would happen if there was a nuclear attack. So these are machines that were very much owned by government, used by government. They weren't machines that everybody had access to.